Hello everyone, and welcome to Chuck's Creations. Today we're going to be looking at and discussing the original Yamaha FC1, why it was so good, some of the specs, and how it changed standard style leader bikes forever. Introduced in 2001, produced till 2005, it really was on its own. It didn't have any competition to speak of for what it was, a naked sport touring bike. Compared to 919 Honda, ZRX 1200, Bandit 1200, BMW, Yamaha did great on combining lessons learned in engineering and otherwise to put a bike together that made sense. 20 years later, and you can still be surprised at how well Yamaha got it on the first go. Simple but somewhat elegant engineering with basic easy to read gauges and an upright riding position. Brakes are phenomenal for its time, borrowed from the R1. No electronics. Whether you're talking Super Duke, FZ09, or any of the other naked bikes, the FZ1 did it first and made a standard for all bikes going forward. Let's go over some specs. So before I get into the specs, I'd also like to mention that this bike was crowned world's best street bike in October 2004. No small feat considering it was nearing the end of production at this time and probably mid-2005. So. To take a look at the specs, we're going to go with the model name, as far as I know it, is Yamaha FCS 1000S. It's a 20-valve dual overhead cam, inline 4, 998cc, 60.9 cubic inches, 74 by 58 bore and stroke, 4 by 37 Makunis with throttle position sensor, 11.4 to 1 compression, digital TCI, 365 watts at 5000 RPM stator output, 124.9 horsepower rear wheel, 73.9 foot-pounds of torque at the rear wheel, with a claimed 154 miles per hour top speed, a wet weight of 509 or 510 pounds, front brake, 298 millimeter floating discs with four piston calipers, the rear was a 267 millimeter two piston caliper, 43 millimeter telescoping fork with adjustable preload compression and dampening, with nitrogen, 142 millimeter, 5.6 inches of travel. The rear was 135 millimeters of travel, 5.31 inches. Has rear tires a 180-55-17, the front's a 120-70-17. A 26 degree rake with a trail of 4.09 inches or 104 millimeters. At 5.5 gallon fuel tank, 21 liters, with a 1.1 gallon reserve, with a recommended 91 octane. Yamaha had a claimed quarter mile of 1055, I don't remember the speed, and a claimed top speed of 177. I can tell you from experience that the quarter mile 1055 is very difficult to achieve even on a modified FC1, but it can be done. Some of the shortcomings of this bike were the rear shock was pretty weak, the front forks could use a heavier spring. Uh, second gear shift fork in the first couple years had an issue sometimes. Um, and there's an oil leak from the shift linkage cover, which if you get one of these bikes and it hasn't been addressed, it's one of the first things that you take apart and put some silicone on so that it won't spring a leak on you while you're out there. One of the plugins for the charging wires from the stator uh, isn't great and it really could be addressed uh, once these bikes get older. Um, you'll see it where it's getting hot and potentially melting the plastic a little bit is pretty short all in all and you know for no electronics uh, super competitive 0 to 60 times still today um, this bike was great it was the first one it was really incredible it's still great to ride and as a hint this is a little bit of a uh, before video so it is undergoing a uh, partial restoration as a hint as to what an upcoming video may include and I have a video here of the replacement engine so you can hear what it sounds like and I appreciate you guys watching and have a listen and I'll see you guys next time